So by removing the top two bolts and bottom one there and leaving the very bottom loose, the caliper now is easily moved. And then we just simply toggle it back carefully while being very careful of the brake line. So we want to make sure that we don't break that. And what we're going to do is toggle that right down. So that it goes right in place to there. And that gets us the ability to remove the disc. Simply a couple of pinks on that baby. And off he comes, which exposes our hub. So now we're going to remove the cap and the large retaining bolt.